Number three, construct a tree diagram showing all possible results when three fair coins are tossed. So let's make the tree, tree diagram. Uh, this is same as flipping a coin three times. Okay, so in first coin we might have, let's say, head or tail. In the second round, when we toss two coins, a head, H, 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 another H. We, al we always add H and T for each, okay? H is already there, T. Now two possibilities, possibilities. T is already there, we just add H or T. So if we toss two coins, then we have one, two, three, four possibilities. Okay, but we have three. So again, just make two from each. And H H is already there. H H is already there. We just add one H T. Same thing here. H T is already there. H T is already there. We add H and T. In this case, T H is already there. T H. Now we put H T. T T is already there. T T is already there. We put H T. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight possibilities. So let me list all of them here. So we can have H H H first. Okay, this. Then second H H T. Okay, you don't have to, but I'm just writing here H T H. H T T T H H T H T so this is same thing I meant T H H this is T H H okay and T T H last T T T one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? Now let's answer the questions. So how many ways we can get at least two heads? At least two heads means two heads or three heads. So two heads, this is three heads, so this is also good. Two, three, okay, now here, four, that's it. Okay, two heads, two heads, two heads, three heads. So at least two heads means three heads is also included also included so one two three four so the answer is four okay part b it says exactly two heads so exactly two heads means uh, this is not the case okay one two three okay exactly two heads one two three there are three ways to get exactly two heads now see no more than two heads no more than two heads means either one head or two heads one or two so let's count uh, three heads no two heads yes two heads yes one head this is also yes one yes one yes okay and no more than two heads that means two heads one head or just one head or zero heads is also there no more than two heads so we can have two heads or one head or no heads maybe this is also there TTT -t -t. so no heads here so there are seven cases okay, there are seven cases where we don't get more than two heads either we get zero heads or one head or two heads okay number four suppose you roll two fair dice of the 36 possible outcomes so in we have to draw a table so one there are six faces in on one die so one two three four five six one two three four five six now one 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 two one three one four one five one six one six okay then two one so you keep writing there will be 36 possible outcomes let me 
go back and draw this okay okay so i just draw all the possible all the, all the 36 possible cases like 1 1 1 2 1 3 etc now answer these questions so how many ways we can get a sum of 5 so let's look at 5 uh, 5 means how to get 5 4 1 5 3 2 5 2 3 5 1 4 5 so there are 1 2 3 4 ways to get a sum of 5 so the answer is 4 ways okay determine the number for which the sum is the following so there are four possible outcomes where the sum is 5 similarly how about sum 9 okay let me erase this sum 9 means uh, 9 6 3 9 5 4 9 4 5 9 3 6 9 Okay, so are there any other nines? No. So one, two, three, four ways. Okay. Now part C. Uh, how many ways we get seven? Seven, six, one, five, two, four, three, three, four, two, five, one, six. So one, two, three, four, five, six ways. Okay, so there are six ways to get seven my bad i went down here six ways to get seven now how many ways we get ten a sum of ten so let me count here ten right so ten is six four ten five five ten four six ten that's it okay one two three so there are three ways to get a sum of 10. Now, how many ways we can get 12? Just one, because 6 plus 6 is 12. That's the only case. So one way. And how many ways we can get a prime number? Now, prime number means what? Uh, 2. So we can get 2 is a prime number. 3, 5, 7, uh, 11. Okay. So how many ways we can get either a 2 or a 3 or a 5 or a 7 or a an 11, okay? So we need to count for each and we want to add. To get 2, there is only one way to get 2, 1, 1. So there is only one way to get a sum of 2. To get 3, 2, 1, 1, 2. So there are two ways to get a sum of 3. How about 5? 5, 5, 4, 1, 3, 2, 2, 3, 1, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4 ways. In fact, that was done here as well. So 4 ways, 7, 7, 6, 1, 5, 2, 4, 3, 3, 4, 2, 5, 1, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It was done in part C. Uh, 6 ways. And to get 11, 11 is 6, 5, and 5, 6, two ways. So 1 plus 2, 3 plus 4, 7 plus 6, 13 plus 2, 15. So there are 15 ways to get a prime number. Okay. Now let's go down to number 5. Okay. Now it asks how many two digit numbers are there in our base 10 system of counting numbers two digit numbers so if we write 07 this is same as 7 and 07 is not a two digit number okay so we have room for two digit one two so there are base 10 means 0 1 2 3 all the way to 9 so 0 cannot be in the first place so there are nine choices for the first digit times and now zero is also available there are ten choices because we can repeat the numbers like we can have seven seven or we can like seven zero okay so nine choices for the first digit 
because we cannot have zero if we have zero like zero seven that's seven which is not a two digit number so nine times ten is ninety so there are ninety two digit numbers now same how many two digit even numbers so one two even numbers means the last digit should be either 2, 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. So how many are there? 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. So there are 5 choices for the last digit. And how many choices for the first digit? Uh, we can have all 10 but 0. So 9 choices. 9 times 5 is 45. Okay. Um, pretty much look, there are 90 two digit numbers and half of them are even 45 number seven okay how many non repeated non repeating odd three digit numbers three digit means first second third odd so the last digit should be okay how many non repeating odd three digit numbers are there in our base 10 system of counting numbers okay odd so odd means last digit should be either one three five seven nine okay so there are five choices for the last digit a uh, first digit out of ten zero cannot go there so nine choices okay now non-repeating means one is already there one number is already there two are gone now out of ten because zero is available now we have how many choices left eight okay so nine times eight times five nine times eight seventy two times five three sixty in eight a four digit number is to be constructed using only the digits one two and three how many such numbers are possible so four digit means one two three four and we can repeat it does not say anything okay so and we have how many choices one two three numbers so three choices for the first digit again three choices for the second digit three choices for the th third digit and another three choices because that's three 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 81 like if you have like three let's say we have digits one two and three we can have like two 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 okay this is a four digit number and this is constructed just using one two and three so we basically use two so we can have like one two three three so there are four digits for each digit we have three choices so 81 possible ways now again four digits so one two three four how many of these numbers are odd odd means the last digit should be look we have one two three we are constructing numbers using only one two and three and we're going to make odd that means either one or three in the last place so there are how many choices either one or three so two choices for last place and less than two thousand Less than 2000 means if we start with 2, then this will be 2 because we are adding 1, 3, maybe 1, 1, 3. Then look, this will be bigger than 2000. So we want to have less than 2000. So we cannot start with 2. So the only choice for the first digit is 1. So there is only one choice, one choice. Okay. Now we can have anything here out of because out of 1, 2, 3 choices, we have 3 choices left here and another three choices left here okay so three times through nine three times three nine times two eighteen final